Hi, welcome back for another episode of Games Overboard. We're here at Small Rec Entertainment Group. I've got Greg here. He's going to talk to us about a couple of their new games. First of all, the one that I'm most excited about. I haven't got to play it yet, but for everybody who owns a fedora in the world, like I do, who wants to make their own Indiana Jones movie on a board game, this is the one I'm thinking about. Am I right? You're absolutely right. Like the idea is the first 10 minutes of Raiders of Lost Ark is more game. Oh, right. It's amazing. Is the guy older that's going to roll you over? Is it more movies or is it more strategy? It is mostly strategy based, but there's definitely no better one. Things like the boulder will pick up speed based on how many dice you roll. I like it. How much a person can do is based on how much you're carrying. The more treasures you got, the story you're going to go. But that's also including a die roll. So there's a mixture of both of them. Components will break it. The theme that will break the artwork is hilarious. Um, looks like all the ones that will blow the rest that you got coming out in right now. This literally just tried to illustrate on Wednesday. This is Frenchstone. You got that? It's a Games Over 1 exclusive premiere. <laughs> With Thunderstone, you are building up the deck by various cards in the village to go into the dungeon and beat up all the big monsters. More really hard to beat monsters, or is it? It's a bit heavier. It's heavier? Alright. You know, we have a lot of other games. Old Rec has a bunch of other games that have played Straw for a number of years. It's a great little hard filler game. And Toon is a good, uh, more dungeon crawl kind of game. I'm going to go over. Oh, uh, we got the expansion to two here. We got the expansion out here. That's all we got for now. Games once again. He's going to talk to us a little bit about his game, Infinite City, that he came out with. So, with this city, you are collectively building a giant city. Each tile is a different building, such as a post office, a transit station, what have you. A bit of a futuristic feel. And the mechanics are very simple. You put down a tile, you put all your tokens on it, and you follow the instructions. That's it. That was my good shot. And then you can just run out of tokens. The game ends when you run out of tokens. Or when all five power stations are playing and walking down the city. Sounds like a great game. I think a lot of fun. I like getting my hands for an hour. I like getting the console. You know, you don't just open the box and play, you can make the game answer. Thanks, Jim.